What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? Normally it would be the mother who declares, if you had one. The whole village would attend, and matriarchs perform the ritual. But we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth, and steel. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this one day. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you? But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! Aloy! And so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough! And you, blessing its name like it was one I of the... I know my duty to the them. Tribe. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow. Aloy! 
some kind of cave? Looks tight, but I can get through. This must be a ruin of the metal book. One of the old places. Ross said you never go in places like this. But I have to find a way out. A metal door. Close. Maybe this device I found can help. How do I get it open? More lights. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Device like the one I found. I think I want it this way. It's the best I can do. Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man.
lining up the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. Well, happy new year, dear diary. Can you believe we actually celebrated last night? Well, we did. Kind of. Director Evans invited everyone to gather in the community room. Don't know where she got the party hats. That was a ghoulish touch. So they always said watching the clock tick down to midnight, and I'm thinking, am I the only one who gets the symbol? How did this? they die here? It might have been worse than if Skyler what got happened? drunk again, but I seem to be a mistake she doesn't want to repeat. And pray for us in this now. Don't belong down there. Come. <sighs> Such places are forbidden. Stay close and do as I say. I know. See this plant over here? It's called South Brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Good. Now eat the berries. They may taste bitter, but they could save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of all Mother's embrace. Embrace? The Nora tribe watches these lands, and keeps out the most dangerous machines. Usually. <laughs> Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Aloy, a machine is coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. There. Now stay low. Stay to one. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. You 
You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. There. See them? These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? <sighs> to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow. Machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy, unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Come, girl, it's safe now. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows.
Good. Now, gather stalks of Ridgewood from the plants over there. Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for our heads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Aloy, they heard you. Don't be so noisy this time. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider. One of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter, if she's careless. You must study the brain. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. Keep firing! You did well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy, quick! Slowly, quietly, so I can sneak past them. Can't let them see me.
their path. Almost there. Oh no. The Watcher saw me. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips! They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that.
said we'd go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? What's he doing up there? He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Aloy, you're here. When you said we were going to go hunting, I didn't realize you meant I'd have to track you down. We must speak. I've been thinking about it, but I fear this. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll, I'll... There's been some... It affords an opportunity to descend into... Fire arrows? What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the Embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the Embrace? Oh... Odd Grotto might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. Wouldn't mind if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> if you say so. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also going to pay Karst a visit. Aloy, that man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. <sighs> and I'm glad he does. Stock it with them. That sounds... Something's really bothering him. Easier when I was a kid. The embrace. My whole life I've never gone beyond this valley. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days and I'll know who she was. And why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. Alright. Time to gather the parts for some fire arrows. I should find a herd. them soon enough. Good. Uh. 
Please. A word? You want to talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. She went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle. And I fear for her life. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? I'll do what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. These are helpful. Bitter, though. Bad day for one of us. worth it.
talk to me, I don't think I'd be very nice. Not a real hunter until you bag a herd of striders solo. Time to see Karst and get a tripcaster. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. My guess is he'll be waiting for me. There he is. Looks nervous. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> Last time I visited, you had a tripcaster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Spec- Oh, I can pay- I'll be the judge of- Now that you've got yourself a tripcaster, practice how to use it someplace else, all right? My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. Really? <laughs> I guess that concludes our business. All right. See you around. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rost at the North Gate.
explosions and shouts from outside the embrace. I wonder what's going on. Aloy, you're here. You have the firearms. I do. Those explosions and shouts beyond the embrace. Is that the trouble you were talking about? You will know soon enough. Until then, we wait for dark. Wait for dark? Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight. Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy. With threats unlike any you have ever faced. Since they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. Follow the path. It's not far. That cabin. What happened to it? A machine. That's what. What sort of machine does that? The sort of machine you're hunting now. Oh, I'll watch your carcass. I'll harvest the parts. Watch your surroundings. Farther now. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribes brave hit this machine? They did. The kills we've passed are theirs. Tomorrow, they will hunt again. They won't need to. This machine will be my kill. Or your death, if you're not careful. as it comes. How many were there? 
I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. <laughs> 